All right, let's proceed. of things to take care of let's see let's if it was abandoned when we arrived who named this place skyhold solar says it changed hands so many times the original builders can't be traced i read the house of armitage once built a fortress in the vicinity five ages ago but the records are lost okay good for the armitages Let's retrieve our allies. Holy shit, how many places can I go? Okay, there is an Evangeline. Okay, Naxus to kill Haynes Grove. Okay. The Skyhold does seem more secure than Haven. Only if we have the numbers to defend it. A place like this serves no purpose without enough people to make the running worthwhile. Whatever. Ooh. A battalion for Sera and Perchiel. Well, I, I will go back to Exalted Marches, but yeah, tell me where I should go next after I finish the Exalted Plains. Exalted Marches, no, Exalted Plains. I, I still need to finish that location. And maybe the Emerald Graves. Did I complete the Emerald Graves? No, I found that rift that was too tough. And I said I would go. Pro more than probably I will keep going back and forth between the Exalted Plains and the Emerald Graves before I I go anywhere else. Yeah, those gain of access operations already require power and they apply immediately. I am level 14. Locate Reese and Evangeline. The freaking cowards went to have sex there. Instead of fighting with the mages. After starting the rebellion, no less. Complete assholes. Okay, let's see what Sera wants. I always do the main quest last, uh, Sinner. Always. I dislike advancing the main plot before I've done everything else. Commander, we have verified Sarah's claims about Bershiel. Several displacement of displacements of refugees were delivered in what appears to be an attempt to destabilize land claims. While there would be no direct gain for involvement the Inquisition, increasing our presence could have unexpected results. In any case, this is a trivial matter. It is a trivial matter to divert troops to march through the city. A retinue of our best will make an impression. I don't I, I whatever. Yeah, let's start meddling the Inquisition in the civil war. Why not? To work? Those are territories by right mine. They are closer to Skyhold than anything else. Plus I'm taking the Emerald Graves and Exalted Plains for myself. This is territory that belongs to Inquisition now. The Empress or the Emperor can forget out. Never turn it back. Locate Reese and Evangeline, why not? Let's see. Sister Leliana, per your request after seeing that no mage named Reese was present at the conclave at the time of the explosion, I began my research. 
It appears based on reports gathered from Rebel Mages that Riggs had originally intended to get the conclave, but the former Templar Evangeline persuaded him not to attend. Okay. She believed corruption within the Templars sought to exacerbate the conflict, and this merited investigation. Ah, okay, so they were not no cowards. Yeah, I, I have a lot of power, but I prefer to focus myself on a few places only and go one by one, basically. One at a time. I like those little stars because they actually allow me to differentiate from things I have seen and things I haven't. The forest near Val Fermin offered many places to hide, but the Inquisition could track down these renegade Templars if so you order. Yes, I order it. I have friends in the area who would gladly rescue someone so important to the Inquisition. Walker knows... What? Walker Texas Ranger is here in this game? I didn't know. She and her scouts can get Reese and Evangeline out safely. Well, I agree. We need those two people. They are important in the grand scheme of things. Uh, yeah, you and Nico, this is my, or Joe, Nico, my first playthrough. Which means that we are playing blind at the moment. Yeah. Inquisitor. That guy is important. He was the swing boat in the independence uh, conclave or reunion, whatever you want to call it. Yeah, fairy, the thing is I come to Skyhold a lot to do all that crafting and inventory management, talking to the companions, so I don't mind uh, hitting the war table occasionally. Let's see if there is another mission. Scout Haven Ruins, Gather Coin, a patrol for the crew. Continuing her predecessor's work. Well, it sounds like something that... That... Uh, she could do. Josephine. A neatly filed request form copied in triplicate and delivered to the appropriate parties. Yeah, I, I'm amassing power left and right. It is ridiculous. But I am not playing like the average person I, I either, so... A neatly filed request for... Uh, request an assortment of flora from Southern Ferelden and Eastern Orle, including several uncommon varieties. See attached the list. Tissue samples from several common herbivores, see attached the list. Access to an accurate map of Southern Thedas and record salvage from Haven. Purpose. My predecessor Minave was studying alterations in feeding and migration patterns in several species following the appearance of the bridge. Her work was left incomplete, I would finish it. Signed Helisma Darrington. Inquisition Researcher and Tranquil. It would be faster to purchase the missing items than hunt them down. My agents can seek reliable resources in Val Royo. Our soldiers can gather any outstanding items. I will double as training exercise for our null recruits. Ah, this sounds good. Contact the University of Orle to see if they have additional materials to aid in her research. Why not? Inquisitor. Power for gold. Instead of gold for power, power for gold. Yeah, that could work. Find the warden. Go low again. Alright. Off we go. Off to where? I'm from... Uh, What? 
Ah. Uh. Colombia. <laughs> All right, where do we go? That is in South America. I, you shouldn't be familiar with the country. Unless you are familiar with cocaine and coffee. Other than that, well, maybe, maybe if you like soccer, you are familiar with our... Or bicycling, or... I don't know how that is actually pronounced. Now what? Let's hit the merchants. It's time to see if the merchants... Inquisitor. Have anything useful for me? <laughs> the Mage Hunter? Woo! L17. It's actually good. Okay, let's take a look at this shit. Yeah, the... I don't know. How... Clockwork Orange, we call it... We always call your... Co your... Your... Uh, your what? Soccer team. The Naranja Mecanica. Which... I would guess it, it's clockwork orange, I don't know if that's the proper translation. Hello, Mango. How would you know I'm gay? I wonder. Maybe you confused me with someone else when you were in that bathroom sucking dicks. All right, on hit, gain three work. Well, this is this is what I like. Uh, a shield that actually gives me guard. That is much better. Mm, explodes. For 75 weapon damage. <laughs> nah, this is not good. Bianca's arms, I'm sure whatever he has the same or worse. Sarah's infused gla what? Common metal? Ah, she sells the rune stones. Okay. Well, that's good to know, then we are back to crafting. Now, fairy, we're not very known for cigars. Those are the Q&Cs. Q and cigars. We, in this country, we never could plant tobacco. To be honest. Many people tried. But Actually, our biggest Cigarette factories are owned by Philip Morris, if you can believe it. Okay, so I need runestones. And we have runes. Giant spider glands. I wish I knew what they did. 
Demon is laying dragon's blood and I know I don't have any dragon's blood. <laughs> Bianca's arms number two. Bianca's aiming. Some craziness. Bianca grip. Ornate Bianca grip. Well, this could finally make Barrick worthwhile. I don't know if I should be too invested in Barrick. Who else has good cigars now? I don't know. Only a few ones that I know of. I'm not really a smoker. I should ask my brother. Don't waste my metal some barrack. <laughs> Uh, I don't know. The problem is I'm I'm fearing that Bioware will once again make me fight with someone oh, that's not in the main party. They will it's, they will put it on my team forcefully. They do that a lot in, in their games. Runes, runes, runes. But yeah, he wouldn't be my first option. How many runes would I need? <laughs> A bunch of them. At least... Uh... Okay, companion quests do that, yeah. That's why that's why I I I I try to spec them as best as possible. Yeah. I know it all I don't mind root people, but whatever. <laughs> Now Barrick seems weak co by comparison. <laughs> How many runes should I buy? Iron Bull, Solar Skull, and the Mage. That's basically the standard party composition in this game it seems one tank or one warrior two mages and one rogue seems the popular one okay mm. let's let's buy everyone has one weapon and one armor and I have four that let's buy eight runestones then. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight. A common metal. Well, I have a bunch of rare metals, so I don't need that. Now for a schematic. Inflicts bonus damage against dragons. Well, I'm not going to fight any dragons. Inflicts bonus damage against demons. But I don't have any dragons blood that I can think of. I think I actually do have dragons blood. Not six. No, no, not sure. Bianca's arms too. Well, let's buy this. I will regret it. But, uh... I already regret it. An ornate Bianca grip, why not? Cold, cold is a little bit off in the head. 
But he's an interesting character. I am inclined to believe now what what Solas is saying is true. That um, well, I'm not inclined to believe. I actually believe it now. That spirits move in a spectrum from good to evil. And Cole was very evil, and now he's actually quite good. That monster, he's a magister. They eat babies and burn everything. <laughs> I heard the same about humans. You did not. We're noble. My father said you're like weeds that choke out the grain. He's old, though. <laughs> yeah, magisters eat babies. Of course they do. Oof, what is this? Why is it so expensive? A rare consensus of guilds and trade partners in some of the influential city-states of the Free Marshes, though no magistrate could penetrate its obfuscating mire of language to drought names, subtle but far-fetching, grants a major increase in the Inquisition's power and influence. Ah, okay. Ah, this is what buying power means. Alright. Really, true love. Humans are noble, humans are weeds. Power and influence. Power and influence, power and influence, power and influence, power and influence. Power and influence, 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 influence. Influence, 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 influence. I would buy influence. N no questions asked. But power, no. Besides, I, at the moment, I don't really need to. I none of that. So I wouldn't. Okay, I think we're. Going to travel to the exalted plains once more. Once more. To talk to the elves. Shit, what a fucking idiot. Then I go. So I could do an operation for the elves? Wasn't this my very purpose? Yeah, but influence is actually useful and power is not uh, arshut, I think. Well, I can gather power quite easily. Well, at least Colin is ready. Yeah, I came here to do uh, an investigation of those cliffs and completely forgot out. Great. Influence gives me perks, which are actually useful. Power gives me nothing because I have a hundred power. I am so powerful I can sit on my throne and laugh. At the paupers that come crawling to my castle in the mountains. Yeah, they go hand in hand. It, that's, it did say power and influence. You are quite correct. I get, yeah, I get power by default. But I like to... Have you heard anything? Not yet. I'll let you know as soon as I do. I don't know, should I spend my money in influence at this moment? Maybe I should and learn how how much exactly is a lot of influence. 
because I would love to get perks, more perks. I should actually check this. Now, no, no, I haven't gained any agents, have I? Okay, I know I have... Did I have... Okay, we marched without incident, although I have it on good authority that there were many closed doors meetings among their shield nobility. Several useful names have sent diplomatic envoys, and potential f future gains may be impressive. Not to tell Sarah I said so. Okay. There was an operation. I remember, they told me. Investigate the glyphs, I remember. Ah, there it is. Ah. Well, this would make sense, that was my original intention. Okay, let's see this. The elven glyphs discovered in the nails might prove valuable. Cursory inspection suggests they predate the ruins in which they were found, possibly transferred onto stone from much older edifice that takes back to the original elven nation or even earlier. Hello, Gigap. Ah, so power could have a deeper influence in the game. Okay. That is entirely possible. Just like... Uh, just like it did on Mass Effect. 3, I mean. At some point you, cost, you crush the threshold to have the happiest ending of all. One of our mages, Eilish Elf, named Cillian, Believes he may be able to translate the glyph, provided we grant him near contacts. Why not? It required some gifts to several Dalish clans traveling along the Waking Coast, but Cyrilan was able to get the text he needed to translate the glyphs. He claims they are a kind of map, showing the location to an ancient temple dedicated to the Earth Hamen, the elven god of secrets. He has provided us the location, but it should be noted we are not the first to investigate these glyphs. A group of treasure hunters evidently mentioned them several years ago, though they have not been heard since. Great. Do I want to venture into the lost temple of the Dirthame? Not, not really. <laughs> that doesn't sound great. The lost temple where adventurers go to die. No, thanks. Okay, now let's go back to the enchanted plains. The exalted plains. Don't I gain favor with the Dalish? Freaking Dalish. Been trying to gain their favor for what? Almost a day. They are relentless. Okay, let's go straight to the Dalish camp. I want to see if they have anything good. So what was my party? It was Dorian, Cassandra, and Sarah. Yes. Good. Well, if power has a, an underlying mechanic, I will tell you. If having more than a hundred doesn't make it work in, for in my favor, then nothing will. She of Highwaymen repents. 
Ah, fuck me. <laughs> no, 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 let's wait. Maybe the, the, the Dalish will have something useful. I wanted to hide that influence to see if I could gain a perk. Need to remember that. I also want to gain the the agent, unless the keeper convinces me otherwise. Ah, okay. The problem is always the loading screens. <laughs> but what if that agent goes to Leliana? If he does, then I will be able to get Defty Fingers or whatever it's called. I come back track and don't. If you could store them in that chest, I would be grateful. Really, I didn't notice I brought supplies. Talk to him. It's good to see you again. Fucking bastard. Gareth Sherald, You're a bastard, you know that. Investig God of Secrets, okay. Have I not gained enough favor? Have I not done. So no, I haven't. I haven't. How is this possible? Someone took cane leather without my permission. Find out who. Greetings to you. What? If I find out who, and okay, I have a lot of wrong. canine leather. So I just need to keep giving them stuff until they do what I wish. Amazing. Do you see something that's going on? My Inquisitor has... It's almost to the next level. She's 14 and a half level. And my companions are almost 14. Why is that? Why am I opening a gap here? Greetings to you. <laughs> Greetings to you. And I have two quests. Uh, the me by the grace of the Danish and well what? I don't believe it. You convinced the keeper. He said I can join the Inquisition if I wish. Really? Well that's news to me. <laughs> keeper Howen has given you permission to join the Inquisition. He has. I'll report to your camp in the south, if that's all right. Carry on, agent. What the hell did just happen? Ah, whatever. It is always a pleasure to greet one of our own. But it hasn't been that big uh, ever, Jacob. This is a big ass gap. I remember at the beginning of the game. I leveled up what, let's say, f one quest before everyone else. Now it seems like it will be a lot of quests before I ever... Okay, what's going on now? Well, let's stop camp. Well, yeah, let's keep the game them shit, why not? Never be on our way. Let's give them shit. They are Danish. They deserve it. We need more, more iron. Yes, iron. I have a bunch of it. Will I ever make this quest? Better first. Nights are getting cold. They're so 
helpless. How is this possible? Well, apparently I finished the quest. Or not. The game crashes. Burns and crashes. Let's wait and see. At least I fast traveled here. Maybe Tien saved after I recruited him. No, I think the game has crashed. Yes. Or not? Yeah, confirmed crash. Give me a moment while I bring this up again. Ah, maybe. I elongate extra experience from reading colleagues. That makes perfect sense. It actually, yeah, it does. The game is crashing left and right today. I don't know why. It's actually quite hilarious. Come to think of it. I also think for capturing purposes, I am going to start playing in windowed mode. To be honest. Because I... I... F mm. I don't know. I, should, I need to run some tests. I found out playing in full screen gives me a lot more FPS. I was playing in borderless windowed. But now that I am in the in the full screen mode, X split keeps fucking everything up every so often. Now, uh, uh, Uzi, what appears to be happening is, I got a perk. A perk that gives me a lot of experience every time I read a book. Mm, or a codex, I find one of those pieces of paper. Apparently all that experience is getting funneled only to me, and not to the companions. So a gap is starting to build between what they receive from quests, common quests, and regular and regular uh, combat, and and what I have accumulated from those sorts of individual uh, experience gathering I do by myself. For example, did you see how much uh, 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 well, experience Cassandra had? Look at how much I have. Or not. Apparently that quest is bugged. I don't think I should be here. Seems to me that quest is bugged. So I think I'm going to get out of this place. Okay, now I gained an agent. And now all I need is a perk to finish the job. Or maybe buy, buy shit. Let's try not to crash the game It is again. always a pleasure to greet one of our own. Do you have anything to trade? Take a look if you like. Ah, memory leaks, okay. The witch's staff. Fire resistant critical damage bonus. No thanks. It's good, but not good enough. Eleven attack, no. No. They sell magical stuff. 
A bunch of it. Barrier damage bonus, volcanic stuff. Roofs of the high keeper. Holy shit. Extra focus for each enemy within 8 meters. Dating back to the period of the Elven Dales when keepers were not leaders and guides for spiritual clans but rather priests who served as archivists and magical scholars, these robes belong to a high keeper of the largest temple of Old Haram Shiral, dedicated to Elgar, the Old Fire and the Eldest of the Sun. Really? I thought Jar of Peace was another was another AOE attack. I haven't used it. What? 14,000? Holy shit. In all honesty, it's not that great. But it is good enough to make me think. But I believe what I have right now is slightly better. To be, yeah, to be honest. Well, 29% ranged. That is good as hell. Superior Enchanter Staff Bleed. Nah. This is the same. And I have something better. More Rune Black. Quillback Leather. Okay. Phoenix Scales. Okay. Ram Leather. Nah, all of this bullshit. Ah, but does it panic your own people? Have you tried it, Florian? Have you thrown a, a, a jar to your own party? The witch staff. No, that's not good. The Templar shield? Why do I have a Templar shield schematic? Dwarven shield. I miss the dwarves, honestly. I like Thor Summer a lot. I wonder if we're going to be dealing with dwarves this game. Dual Spike Shield. Okay, the Templar Shield is 6 gear. I need to remember that. Great Sword. I only buy shit that gives me gear. The rest I don't really care. Dagger Grip, okay. So 6 gear on the Templar shield. Let's take a good look before I forget. Six gear on the Templar shield. Six gear, it's a weapon schematic. Fuck me. Six gear on the. No, it's the same as the Dark Spawn shield. It actually has the same. I can't throw it at the start of the battle. I can't throw it at the start of the battle. Yes, I could. You know what? I'm going. I'm, I'm going back and looking and comparing the peach. I have the peach uh, grenade on my tank. I will compare both of them and see if there is one that's better. You are quite correct, I didn't think of it. What I like though the peach the peach uh, grenade is that it is very specific, it gives bonuses to your allies. Okay now this warden warrior schematic. Eight gear warden battle mage armor. Nine gear, okay. That's good. Sturdy hunter armor four gear. Hmm. Or utility, I prefer to say gear. Superior warden helmet. They have good shit, these guys.
Yeah, O'Neill is correct. He was fast. Okay, let's go one by one. Eight gear and nine gear for warrior and mage. Warrior and mage. Warrior and mage. Warrior and mage. Mage. Eight gear. Eight gear. Eight gear. I have nothing with eight gear. Okay, that is a very good piece of equipment. But out the warrior. Eight, nine, not no, whatever. It is actually good as well. Okay, we need to buy those two schematics. What do you know then? The English? We, the English, are actually quite resourceful and intelligent. Unlike those Orlesian imbeciles. Uh, for gear for the rogue. Forgot. And the Warden Helmet. How much is it? How much? Not how much is it? How much does it have? Seven gear on the Warden Helmet. I wonder how the Adventurer Helmet looks like. Interesting. I will buy both of them. Vanguard Armor Arms, holy shit, these guys have the best stuff in the game. Enchanter Armor Arms and Vanguard Armor Legs. Okay, let's go one by one. Helmet 7 and Rogue 4 gear. Helmet Sen and Rogue 4. Helmet Sen and Rogue 4. Helmet 7 and Rogue 4. Helmet 7 and Rogue. Mm, it is barely better. Okay, an increase is an increase. Fuck it all. And Rogue 4, let's see, now I already have something that's much better, it has 8 gear slots, which is much better. Okay, I also remember the Vanguard arms, and Vanguard legs, also for these people. They are better, holy shit, we're back to crafting. Crafting is back on the menu, boys. Yeah, it is. Definitely. And you know what, let's buy the adventurer hat. By both of them, of the money. Vanguard armor arms, yes. And enchanted armor arms and the legs. Let's see, nothing, nothing, nothing. I think I have barely enough money to buy one of those books and see if it increases my. My perks. Alright, then let's go and craft. No, I, I, I didn't buy the mystery box. I had the money and I decided to buy schematics instead. So, and, and, and once again I was appro approaching the 10,000 threshold, and I DM buy it. It's always the same. Every time I have 10,000 gold, I find the schematics I want to buy. It's always the same. And this time I will be able to use that, that, that fate touch thing. 
to make it a masterwork or whatever it's called. Now that I think of it, I haven't gained a fate touched anything in quite a while. It's rather strange, isn't it? Alright. Hmm. What is that demon potion? I cannot farm. Okay. We are going crafting. Mark of the Rift. Worship. Hmm. Okay. It's mostly armor, but it is not only armor. Okay. Time to look at the... at the inventory. Again. Weapon schematics. Bianca arms. An ornate Bianca grip. Okay, let's remember that. Bianca arms, an ornate Bianca grip. In all honesty, I shouldn't do that first. Because Bianca is a secondary concern. So let's do the armor. The armor is for my main companions. Um, Warden Battle Mage Armor. Um, Warden Warrior Armor. Why did they disappear? Okay. Yeah, these two are warrior Warden Warden Battle Mage and Warden Warrior. Okay, let's see. Let's see what we can craft. Warden Warrior Armor. That looks impressive. Let's see. 12 constitution, 8 strength, 8 constitution, 8 strength, mixture, mixture, strength, pyrophyte. I have a bunch of pyrophyte now, thanks to Colin, actually. Strength. Summer, okay, pyrophyte it is, 12 constitution, what about you, armor, armor, whatever, I don't care, uh, most common one, I don't really care about armor, <laughs> yeah, I, <laughs> I, I, I almost clicked, on the thing, but I, I then I said, now let's go and look at some, uh, at some uh, summer stone. Huh? Actually, looks a little bit interesting. All those colors. Well, summer stone is the more plentiful, so it is summer stone. I don't really care how it looks, to be honest with you. Bear hide. Okay, 12 constitution and 8 ranged. That's the best. 8 on being hit. No, I don't really like that. Cold resistance. 8 ranged. Cold resistance. Okay, that seems like the best. 12 constitution and 8 ranged. Let's go with the nugging thing. Nox skin. What about increase maximum stamina by 15? Heal 15, damage 
taken over 10 seconds. Heal 15% of damage taken over 10 seconds. Okay. On dying, 10% chance to heal of half health. Okay. 10% chance to inflict chain lightning damage at 50% of weapon. Okay. Heal 20% damage taken over 10 seconds. Alright. 10% chance to use healing blades on hit with 4 added hits. Alright. Already cost 7.5 less mana stamina. Alright. Berserk, 10% more damage and 100% damage to all soldiers. Alright. 10% chance of masterwork. 20% chance of masterwork. Okay. This is interesting. I don't know if I should waste it. Honestly, I think only the last armor I make should have this shit on. At least the ones I really like. The other ones I can toss it in, in the... But the ones I really like, like 10% chance of revival, 15% damage returned, that, that shit I should save for the ending, I think. I don't know how rare of any of these is, but it sure does seem rare. Look at the small amounts I have of everything. Okay, but without that, it's 12 constitution and 8 ranged. But that's my current tank have. The tank. She is Cassandra. She has six constitution and na nothing else. Six constitution. So it is a much better thing. Right off the bat, it's much better. What about the other tanks? Black Bull. He's not wearing anything that can be upgraded. Okay. What about? I don't bullshit. Nothing either. Alright. Use iron back. Okay. Yeah, those generic. It's, n it's not like I don't know which one to use. Uh, but what I uh, what I do know is which ones I don't want to use while I'm so far away from the end game. That's, that's more or less what I'm trying to say. I saw a few that are really amazing for my... Uh, no death rule set. And a few others that are crappy as hell. So I can actually give, give, it, give them over without much hesitation. Yeah, this is going to be great. Alright, then it is settled. Pyro fight. Uh, summer stone. Because it is plentiful and I don't really care about armor rating. Uh, hello, Clegane. Gregor Clegane is here, huh? I am honored, Sir Gregor. Alright, let's see what I can toss, just for... Increase maximum stamina, no, honestly, no. You're telling me I just should use Ironberg. Poof. Yeah, that, that character I, I like very much. <laughs> All right. Critical crafting chance. Twenty percent. You know what? I I don't. 
It's only 10% chance of success which won't be helpful at the end of the game gear anyway. Yeah, I agree. Let's let's see. It may work, it may not work. It doesn't matter in any end. This thing is too awesome. Ha! It actually worked. <laughs> Enduring deflecting warden armor. No, no. This is... Uh, very bad description. You need to say it's 14 con 9 ranged def. And that's not what I wanted. That's what it should say, you fucking assholes. That is the proper naming of an item, in my opinion. Enduring, enhancing, blocking, reflecting, dancing, armor. No, that doesn't tell me shit, you fucking assholes. More constitution, yes, please. Nine constitution, great. She will have all the constitution she will ever need. I think Pyrophyte is once again the order of business here. And maximum health? Uh, Staggeron being hit? No. Maximum health? Not really. Melee defense? I would prefer magic defense, but I'll take what I can. Stagger on being hit, stagger on being hit, melee defense. Mm. Paragon Luster is rare. Skid Mark breaches of revulsion. <laughs> ah, really? Breaches of repulsion. Well. They should be called Breaches of Birth Control, then. I would name them that. Breaches of Birth Control, yes. Five melee defense on Beridium. Well, that's... I think that's the best I'm going to get out of all this bullshit. Five melee defense on Beridium, yes. Come here. Nine con five M def. There we go. No, how do I distinguish magic from melee? M doesn't work. Uh, let's put me. 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 Def. MG. Now, let, uh, let's call M an MG. That makes more sense. M is melee and MG is magic. That makes some sense. Alright. Well, that worked out nicely, didn't it? Now, legs, the legs, all right, more constitution, how is this possible? Yes, more constitution, give it to me, all the constitution you can handle, all right, what do we have here, cold resistance, Range defense tree that is winning. Range defense on tree. Who gives more? Who gives more? The knock skin is the same. Five on the rough height. Five range defense. Mm, 
six snack skin is three ten this is the other one twelve on the bronto hide I don't know yeah beautiful look at those toes aren't those beautiful toes when you want to lick them Just stick them up you're okay interesting I didn't notice she doesn't even wear sandals what do you know nah let's take the tree and, and, and run with Bronto hide yes Trafite them another nine constitution Nine con three are deaf. Ha <laughs> uh, I know that fetish is all around the internet. No, I don't find toes particularly exciting. I'm more of a Nazman. Although, no, no, mm, yeah. A Nazman, yes. All right, now the mages. Well, in all honesty, I need to do this for everyone. A warden battle mage armor. This is going to be great as well. I can already feel it. Enchanted armor arms, and in, and nothing else. Yeah, the legs were the other ones. All right, let's go. She looks great. I like when my mages have uh, capes. She looks badass, honestly. Amazing. She actually looks like my bounty hunter from the Old Republic. Fourteen constitution, yes. More constitution. I have no problem with that. Fourteen constitution. Come to Papa. Holy shit, this is demanding. Lamps wool. Ooh, this one looks pretty, and I have a bunch of it. Sixty-eight. The ring velvet. The ring velvet is winning just because I have most of it. Uh, in armor, I always use whatever I have most of. And the, the ring velvet definitely is it. Yeah, the hat fits with the the metal in the in the shoulders. She doesn't look like she's wearing a peace spot in the head. All right, let's go. Nine rank range defense from the Bronto. Uh, cold, cold. I need to kill more animals. That's the lesson I'm getting from this. Kill more animals. The dog skin. Harvest more animals. All right. Problem is this, I have that 16 magic on the keeper, on the keeper, uh, on the keeper. Which is very much comparable to what we have here. 16 magic and 10% focus gain. It is very much alike. And the keeper cannot be worn by a mage. Um, uh, not a mage, that's a stupid. Uh, 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 what? Fuck, I forget it. That armor cannot be worn by a human, that's what I meant. A human mage. Okay, let's go with the iron bark again. Let's do it. So, this is definitely better than what 
than what uh, the the human guide is using Dorian. So let's craft it right away without having to compare or anything. Sadly, it won't go on my elf, and we fail. Massive fail. So we got with 14 con. Now 14, 14 con. 9 are deaf. Good. And now the same goes for the enchanted armor arms. These won't serve well. Lilith. Ah, but you know what I can do? I can switch the hats. So I can give her the the Inquisitor hat and, and the Peace Pot helmet goes to the to Dorian. He will look at least somewhat good. Okay, dexterity doesn't work for a mage. Cunning does. So the Bronto Hide is winning. Yeah, the Bronto Hide is winning. Except the rough hide pulls it off in the end. Nine cunning. Why not? I cannot craft it? Why? Okay. Why then? Why then it craft? Did you see? Ah, I didn't use the other one. What the fucking moron. Okay, let's go. Heal bonus. He already has heal bonus, so that could be worked. Uh, hmm. Five magic. So it is woo cloth that gives magic defense. I need to remember that. Cloth gives magic defense. I need to remember that for the future. Magic defense. Heal bonus. Eight heal bonus. Shit. Spindle weave. Spirit, magic, magic, or velvething. Well, I'm really torn by this. He has five health bonus. And he can heal from the death that corpses and all that shit so he could be constantly healing in battle as we progress but on the other hand we have magic defense now in all honesty healing is better in, in dungeons it would be better and it, it should also prevent him, hopefully, from using oh, that many potions. Uh, in a long, big, drawn out battle, that will help the most. I hope. <laughs> yeah, let's get the healing bonus. 8%, 24. Let's see which one. 24 and 8%. That's winning. By winning. That wins, definitely. Where is the 24? There it is. Last you Scott. Alright. The shrewd healing enchant water. Nine Kun. <laughs> Eight. 8 HP 
bonus. Now, eight kill. Yeah, whatever. That sounds right. Nine con, eight heal. That sounds out right. Okay, now for the rogue. The roguish rogue. No, I think I didn't buy anything. No, I did buy something for the rogue, didn't I? I think it was... But I don't remember. Let's look at the inventory. Isn't this amazing how much time you can spend in this shit? The enchanted armor arms. <gasps> done. Vanguard armor arms. Done. Vanguard armor legs. Done. Turns out they didn't buy anything. For the... I need to look at the adventure hat and the warding helmet. Okay. I know I'm getting eight, not eight, six, six um, willpower from the peace pot helmet. Nah, I didn't buy shit. Okay. Yeah, the Inquisition had six willpower. Let's see if I can make anything better. That, look at this. Completely ridiculous. Well, this will decide everything. In end, dexterity, sign cunning. Sand dexterity. No, dexterity doesn't cut it. It's not for the mages. No, not for anyone, honestly. Dexterity is too narrow. I prefer willpower all the time. Mm. So, the adventure hat is no good. What about the warding hat? Look at that. <laughs> Holy Jesus Christ. Delaying constitution. That blows away anything I have. Delaying constitution. For everyone. Oh, or is this only for a rogue? Not for a warrior. Is it for a warrior? If it's for a warrior, I'm going to... Warrior, yes, it is for a warrior. This is for a for a rogue. Okay, I need to read those descriptions a little bit better. Okay, so for a rogue, I would be sacrificing willpower for how much increase in dexterity? Five. Well, that is. I think that is something that can be worked worked out honestly it's a big increase in dexterity five points yeah I think I cannot justify not doing it okay let's switch helmets for the rogue and the and the Tank. Let's make it Hala leather since it's going to be for a fellow. A fellow what? Mm, elf. Iron is winning. Summerstone wins by default. Summerstone is really shitty, isn't it? Maybe I should see if there is anything on 18 that's plentiful. Pyrophyte. 
A pyrofight gives me... Nah, it doesn't matter. Armor is the least of my worries. Okay, craft. Uh, no, this this can actually be named whatever the name the game wants. Helmets don't get uh, upgrades, so it doesn't matter. The agile cap, yes, game. The agile cap, whatever you say. Land constitution, yes. Eleven Constitution, the Pyrofight. This is still the best bet. Yes, it's always Pyrofight or Pyrofight or Bloodstone. I don't even know what I look at the other ones. It's always the same. 18 armor. I think we're in the same thing. It's Iron or Blood Summerstone. Summerstone it is. Enduring Helmet. Good name. Alright, I think we are finally done with this. Isn't it crazy? Pretty sure I'm done with this. Yeah. Alright. Great. Now, we need to equip all this shit. The fun begins. Armor. This one. Mage only. What do you know? Doesn't have any... It's not... Really? That is a surprise, to be honest. Doesn't have any slots. Why would that be the case? That's the first time it has happened. I thought every crafted armor had arms and legs. Turns out I was wrong. What do you know? You can actually wear this? What? Fucking game bastards.
muted phone call.
Okay, I'm back. Yes, he killed the prisoner. He always kills the prisoner. He brought the make maker's justice, is what he says. To a deserter, a thief, a coward, a traitor. A thousand health. Okay. Let's see, because... I'm intrigued. Apparently she has so much constitution now that it doesn't even register. Look at the core stats. It's filled. Does this matter? Let's see. I want to know. I am curious. Yes, it does matter. It's not much because I have so much fucking health. But it is 50 HP. No, Ariok, I don't think he knows that happens. You could tell him, but he c I don't know if that would change his mind. Uh, because he, what he says is that he needs to show regret and ask for the maker's forgiveness, something like that. That's what he always says would prevent him from killing the guy. I don't know if thanking the maker for food qualifies. So what do I get? More defense? So little defense for 50 HP. Is that... 50 HP. Yeah, Ariok. That's that's what I, I've always seen him kill the the prisoner. Always. Well, how do you experts in the chat? Well, I, I am conflicted about these two armors. One has more constitution, 50 HP, but has 32 less, not 37 less armor, and a little bit more of defense, range defenses especially. <laughs> yes, that's very true, Ariok. If the guy doesn't believe in the maker, he wouldn't thank him for kindness of strangers. That is very true. Con is too important, okay. Con is too important, then we will go with Constitution. Which means the Warden armor will go to the Warden. Seems logical. Well, it cannot go to a fucking Warden. Because then the Cunari will be naked. Mm. Which means it goes to a Cunari. <laughs> Look at this! Finally, they, they put clothes over the nipples. I am surprised. He, ha he doesn't have a... Uh, <laughs> he doesn't have a neck. <laughs> he doesn't have a neck anymore. Great. Love it. I am impressed. Mighty impressed. Bioware. Okay. I think we're done with all this bullshit. To be completely honest. Yes. Okay, now I can make... No, willpower. I cannot make willpower equipment. But we're as good as we're going to be. So, it's back to a war table. Is he streaming? Are you? Is Lass streaming? Uh, I wonder. 
I don't like uh, missing his streams. But yeah, the O'Neill overflow for the win. I wonder why they didn't make that a dynamic, uh, a dynamic uh, range. They are so smug, these people. I will laugh when everything crumbles under their feet. It's Inquisitor, Evangeline, and I owe you our freedom. Really? And indeed, our very lives. I am greatly saddened to hear what happened at the Conclave. I had truly hoped for a peaceful end to this conflict, and the death of so many good people is a tragedy. Our investigation took us to renegade Templars using a strange new red form of lyrium. I am chagrined that they were powerful enough to subdue us, although your agents tell us that these red Templars serve as shock troops for the enemy, who has both mages and Templars dancing, dancing to his tune. Evangelina and I need to recover from our wounds and our presence at the Skyhold will only cause tension with the real mages you brought into the Inquisition. Once we are healed, we would be honored to serve. Sir Rhys, Senior Enchanter of the Aquitarians. I don't understand. Why? He is a real mage by all intents and purposes. I don't understand. Ah, you're back going back to the AO. Well, if if uh, I stop streaming anytime soon, I will host you through loss. Ah, hello, Monty. Sleeping the yeah. I actu I actually catch the very end of his uh, mind game stream. Deploy Reese and Evangeline. Okay. Why not? They seem like thoughtful persons. Ah shit, I didn't read Cole's letter, fuck. Does anyone know what Cole's note said? I, I didn't read it. I'm guessing he is angry. To be honest, friending Quirinius, no. Investigate Hunter's Fell, no. Repair point agur. Nah, let's hope. Let's wait until I explore the regular part of the exalted plains before I jump into the more shit. Scout the ruins. Okay, let's do this. A formally submitted Report current progress and findings. Certain herbivores appear especially sensitive to disruption caused by the rifts. Migration and mating heights have been impacted. Ramifications on predator behavior apparent, but warrant further study. Additional notes. In studying alterations in animal behavior, I have uncovered something the Inquisition soldiers may find useful. Human behavior is similarly unpredictable. I will continue to pursue this line of research until otherwise notified. What? So a rift also affect humans. That's what she's telling me, apparently. At first I was angry, but your action saved them. Okay, thank you very much, Gigup. So he was angry, he told me to fuck off. Deploy Reese and Evangeline. I'm sending them deep into Red Templar territory, it seems. Hmm. <laughs> yeah, so I saved them so I could put them in danger again. What a great hero I am. Okay. Let's see. We have recovered from our wounds and are ready to serve the Inquisition as you see fit. Angeline has friends among the Orlesian nobility who may listen to our cause, and I am familiar with several caches used by the Royal Mages. Or, if you prefer, we would be honored to join the Inquisition troops 
near Val Fermin and fight the forces of Corypheus of Corypheus as best we can. Ooh. Yours in service, Riz and Evangeline. A passionate warrior coming from a good family might bring us by might bring the Inquisition a great deal of gold. And I have gold oozing out of every orifice. So I don't I don't really the Cassius Reeds speaks of my yield something of value. An experienced Templar and a powerful mage would greatly increase our military strength, Neil Val Fermin. What the hell is Val Fermin? I'm, I'm not sure which one is better. You know what? Let's send them to r reclaim caches. Let's see what we have. Hello, Flex. I do plan to stream Witcher 3 if I can buy it. I should be getting enough money to buy it by this uh, January the 10th, and I will pre order it. So I can play it on release. Yes, I do plan to do that. I even get a nice discount because I bought the Witcher 2 from them and they are giving a 10% discount already. Let's see what this is. This seems like a job for calling, yes. We've had a request for some general patrols. It is heartening that we are being looked to in this way, but I doubt we would find any activity directly related to Corypheus, and our resources are better sent elsewhere. The request was in the same region as the bandits reported by the Sutherland lad. Perhaps we should extend his duties? Yes. I'll not define the Sutherland boy, he will be have minor sanction to patrol. Yes, do it. Inquisitor. That guy has proven himself to be capable. I don't know. I plan on replaying The Witcher 1 and The Witcher 2. Uh, ah, I also get a, a discount for The Witcher 2. One, actually. You get a discount for every Witcher you bought. Even if it wasn't from them. I, the Witcher 1 I didn't buy from them. But I did did get the Witcher to from Gog, I mean. Scout the Haven Ruins. Let's see what this is all about. Per our conversation, I would like permission to send some of the chargers to Haven. Our goal is to find any gear. Ah, yeah, yeah. Lost in Corypheus' attack. Check for enemy stragglers and bring refugees who have not yet found Skyhold. Cremisius Aclasi, aka Shepherd. What are we dealing with? The only way we'll bring in refugees is through our allies in Ferelden. After Haven, they are more than willing to help. What? We have no idea how many enemies remain at Haven. The charges ha had best go in numbers. Okay. The only way we bring in refugees is through our allies in Ferelden. After Haven, they are more than willing to help. I don't understand. Is she proposing I do not send the chargers? That's what it sounds to me like. No, if that's the case, I won't do it. I, I want... I want them to go. Okay, so let's send her to gather some resources. Honestly, I, I am not sure 
Mm, well, I, I haven't finished The Witcher 2, but I'm not sure uh, how the premise of Witcher 3 uh, really facilitates the importing of decisions from the previous game. Let us begin. Yeah, let's leave it like this. Good enough for the moment. So I do know a little bit about what the state of the world in Witcher 3. Cole approves acquired corrupting rune. Let's go and see if I can use it. I think those are the ones that do damage to the living. Ooh. Ah, the charges go on all three choices. Just how you are aiding their effort in their choice. Well, I wouldn't want the charges to get killed. I don't know if Corifius has. So yeah. I'm thinking Inquisition? Has forces in the. <laughs> in the what? Shit. I forget. Aha! 20 damage versus the living! Okay. Well, I don't want them to get bushwhacked, that's what I mean to say. To get bushwhacked in the... Okay. Problem is I don't do much, much damage. Who is the person that does ma more damage out of... Out of the... Or should I use it? I don't know. No, it's always it's the... The... The, the mages. The mages and... Zed already has... What? A dragon is... Not, okay, a corrupting rune, yes. Corrupting rune. Dorian doesn't have shit. Who does more damage? Dorian... I would say Dorian eventually will do more damage. So I don't know that uh, Knight Specialization. How will I specialize? I cannot find the ingredients for the whatever I'm trying to eat. How rare are runes? How do I craft a rune actually? Should I be able to craft runes by now? I think I can. Yes. I don't have enough of anything. Shit. Great. Red Lyrium. Okay. What's this? Lightning Essence. Okay. Frost Essence, Red Lyrium. An intense lightning is intense, imagine that. It's not regular, it's intense, really intense. I completed a quest, amazing. Okay, so it is quite rare. Let's see what... What... Rift Loot. Okay, thanks, Flex. Who has more damage? Or who has more damaging abilities? Mm. Question. I, I g gave a rune to Sarah, a corrupting rune. Question. The rune only affects basic attacks or any attack that uh, originates from the weapon with the rune. Three hundred weapon damage. Okay. Two hundred weapon damage. Per. 
hit. So, well, that should be better. Or I can buy the essences. Hello, Sloth. I'm from Northern South America. <laughs> I like to play that game, actually. Ah, but he has his tree. Let's look at his tree. The tree of necromancy. It's only fear. And he does heal. From China. <laughs> ah, China. The best capitalist country in the world. Well, I don't know. Seems to me like I, I should give it to... To... to him because all he has is weapon damage based 75 weapon damage uh, blah 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 uh, while Lilith is not weapon based I uh, know it is weapon based fucking bullshit yes but uh, our country is very diverse, Flex. So, how do you like your women? If you can describe them to me physically, I mean basic traits, skin, color, hair, color, height, uh, things like that. Big breasted, or a lot of room in the back, things like that. I, I can tell you which cities to visit. So you find yourself your preferred type of women. Yes, a thick Spanish accent. Or or yeah, a Latin accent, very true. I could try to change my voice if you wish. But that does strain my vocal cords, I found out. In other games when I had to voice act. Although I am not very good at doing other accents. But I can change the pitch quite easily. I think. So, I believe... I don't know what to believe. I'm going to give it to Lilith. She seems the one more likely than not to take advantage of those points. At this particular moment in time. Thanks, Jacob. As long as I, uh, I am understood, I am happy with that. Many people do tell me it gets at least a little bit of time to get used to my accent. They don't understand me at first anything, anything I say sounds like Jewish. But after a while they, they adjust. That, the same happens to me when I, when I hear British people. I really need to concentrate to understand what they are saying. Well, the accents from Britain. For example, this streamer, uh, Spamafish. That guy, I, I really need to concentrate to understand what he's saying. 
Okay, goodbye corrupting run, I hope. I'm not going to find a better stuff anytime soon. <laughs> oh, yes, yes. Fucking bullshit. So, last but not least, let's buy influence and see if I can get a perk. Which is something else I wanted to and forgot. Like, a, like an imbecile. I always forget that stuff. And to sell this to the Grey Wardens, I will sell. To the. What other accents do I have travel with? I think I understand almost all American accents. Doesn't really matter where where you are from, the United States. I think I understand I can understand anyone. But there are some British accents that really put me to the test. <laughs> ah, Semper. Six Semper Tyrannis. That's what I say to you. Alright, let's buy influence. Hopefully, spending that much coin will give me... Enough for a... for a... Perk. That's what I wanted to say. Let's spend all our money in this stupid thing. The Protocols of Passage Free Marshes. Let's see if there is anyone. Deep Louisiana Cajun. English. Hmm. I will search it in YouTube. Shit, they are too expensive. Nah. Grants a significant increase. Grants a major increase. Hmm. I'm 700 gold. I think I'm going to get Deft Fingers. Unless I can gain the attribute point for the Inquisitor. By the first tier, yeah, Funk, I, that's what I'm, I'm thinking. Buying this, but I don't have enough money. I'm missing a little bit of money. And I don't think I can sell anything that I, I, I really... I wouldn't really miss, that's what I meant to say. Let's look at that armor. What am I, I'm holding on for that armor. Is it a good armor? I don't think it is. Not anymore, at least. Not for her. I mean. Level 15. Deft fingers will give me an amulet of power. Okay. Yeah, ah, tier one is the cheapest. Ah. Okay, I almost thought the other way around. So are telling me I should buy this one, the private trade agreements and all that shit. What? Is that the exchange rate? Are you serious? Ten influence is worth nine F for for. 4,900 gold? That cannot be... That, can that be a truth? Then what will, what will this give me? Nothing. This is not even 10% of 4,900 gold. I 
Ah, you, you, all right. The cheapest is still there. Okay, if you say so, I will believe you. Let's buy this. How much will it give me for one of the cheap things? 150. Okay. So let's see. Let's I, I let's see how how distorted their sense of worth is. This is worth what? Three times what the other one? 180. Yeah, more or less three times. Sell it before leaving the menu. Ah, okay, Scorpion, you're saying I only need to buy it. Well, one thing is cheesing. I don't know, that's tricking. Well, that's also... <laughs> that's tricking the game. Is it... Is it... Let me think out. Will... Would I do that? I don't know. That's... Well, that's not what I precisely in combat that is tricking the game yes I, I think but also I also trick the AI but this is something I'm doing purposefully now nah, let's spend the money money is not important That's what I actually want. Okay, but let's see how distorted their sense of worth is. Let's buy this. It's three times the other price, more or less, give or take, a few gold. So it should give me 450 influence, shouldn't it? But th very, I, I, I thank you for the suggestion, Scorpion. Uh. Okay, let's see. Yes, you are quite correct. They are insane. It costs three times as much, but it only gives you two times as much influence. That's insane. Okay, then let's buy all the all the lesser the lesser ones but I'm going to buy them and spend the coin because I am actually getting something out of this something that is very valuable and then I, that I should really sweat it for they are completely insane okay let's spend all the money that is nine so we should see more than a thousand. Quite true, more than a thousand. Okay. Tier one, then tier three. Fucking insane. It's like when I go to a supermarket and I see a bundle of three things that is more costly than the single uh, the single good by its own it's completely insane will I gain a perk? that's the question here yes, great a new operation Savelo? really? every time you increase influence you gain more operations? That's a surprise to me. Private deals with the main merchant houses, why not? I should pay attention to what I'm buying, to be honest. Well, let's see, Funk, if I'm going to get the left hand perk. If I... Uh, I will go... Once I get it, I will go to all the... Uh, locations I have already explored. And I know... 
have locked locked uh, huts or whatever favorite agreements with the merchant houses okay whatever all right that was good power is useless but inference is quite we're quite. ready for the chance this evening there will be room for you uh, worth the price let's fast travel you know always forget they can fast travel where am, where am I going? Ah, the war room, yes. Mm. So, if you tell me, for example, the amulet of power is in... Mm. In what? In Logan's possession. Go and find Logan, I won't do it. I would thank you for your information, but uh, you can get three talent points per playthrough without cheating for the Inquisitor. Okay, that's good news. Welcome news, even. Alright, let's see where that elf turns up. Nothing he offers me, well, other than focus, but. I need to learn to use focus. Honestly, I need to. One question about focus. I've seen that they say the abilities have tier 1, 2, 3. Does that relate to this? To the maximum focus? Is tier 1 focus, 1 bar of focus, and tier 2 fo focus ability using 2 bars of focus? Uh, I, I, I am not... Shit, motherfucking elf came here. Stupid elf. Loranil's involvement with the Inquisition cements an alliance with his clan. Great. The perspective of an English elf also gives the Inquisition forces an added advantage. Everyone says yes. Okay, thanks. Thanks a lot. Okay, so advanced focus is somewhat useful. Looking at it from that perspective. Optimal cutting, eagle eye, enhanced studies. Well, I could get enhanced studies. Yeah, I do, I do uh, see how Cassandra's power is good, because it gives guard to everyone, doesn't it? Uh, that's how it works, as far as I could understand it. Cassandra can give guard to the whole party. Knowledge of nobility. Now, that, uh, that I will get when I, when I start dancing in the game. Or playing the game. All of this I don't like. Uh, what is it that... She doesn't have anyone. Okay, I have three points. I could put the fourth point. Or wait and see if I can gain another agent. I could get this. Okay, let me see what you're saying, Funk. Craft something for Sarah with hidden blades and use thousand cuts. If you use Fire Flask before it will not be depleted. I'm guessing the... Ah, of course. Because it, it, three, it, three, ah, uh, yeah, it, it what? Destroys cooldown, something like that, and doesn't cause your stamina to go away. Well, I don't know, no, no, that doesn't make any sense because focus is a separate thing from stamina. Would not be depleted, but will be available 32 minutes, 32 seconds after the uh, cooldown of Fire Flask.
Ok. Mm, Alright. I think I kind of understand what you're telling me, but maybe once we get to the... Gain a collection of herbs. That's actually looking good, sadly enough. I don't want to spend a point in this bullshit. I can tell you that much. Fire flask and then thousand cuts. And you don't deplete focus? But you need hidden blades. Is, is, I'm getting this right. You don't deplete focus or, or, I, or, or I'm... Or do, you, or do you gain enough damage that basically focus comes along again? I, I don't have a specialization, Scorpion. But I'm a mage. I could get necromancy. But the other day we were talking about what an elf would get. And it seemed to me like uh, the best option was was uh, Knight Enchanter because one, the trainer is an elf and two, it is elven knowledge lost for a thousand years, not really but in Dragon Age Origins they do make it plain that Arcane Warrior was an, a, a, a discipline that the elves had mastered and it was lost when the Tevinters took over Arlathan so, I think I'm left. What is a keep? I've captured a bunch of places. What the hell is a keep, you fucking bastards? I think we've left with only one option, and that's enhance the studies. Does anyone disagree with this choice? You can get 20 Inquisition per points. Okay. Uh, what I want is... What I want is... Well, yeah. The thing is I need to make the most of the uh, out of these perks right now. So... Um, the, the quickest way to, uh, to, uh, to an ability point is Deft Hands, as you say, or uh, Antiguan Tailoring, so I can get the point right away in in the Inquisition slot. The difference is that Enhanced Studies opens Deft Hands and is useful in itself, while Antiguan Tailoring is a piece of shit. Because I am not a hoarder anymore, although I, I was for a very long time. So... I think I'm going with Enhanced Studies. Also, a big HP. The Crestwood area. I don't know where Crestwood is now. I don't remember. I'll tell you what I've done. Hinterlands, Storm Coast, Fallow Mire, Emerald Graves, and Exalted Plains. I don't think I've gone anywhere else. No. Hello RJ, well, I thank all of the viewers and followers, I haven't checked my email, but I'm sure we should have a few new. Yeah, thank you very much for watching and being so helpful. Let's hope we don't die, because then we're throwing away 90 hours of playthrough. <laughs> how is that even possible? I, I don't see how I can die. Ah, I won't get an ability point right away with deft hands, alright. Well, I'll tell you this. After I go to... After I deplete the emerald grave... Well, the emerald graves are depleted. I won't go there until I'm level 16 again. 
So, Emerald Graves is out of the question. Only the Exalted Plains and that uh, temple of whomever I... The, the secret god... No, the god of secrets. Those are the two places I plan to visit in the... In the what? Short run. So, you can tell me where I should go after that. And in the meantime, I will gather enough influence, I think, to get this perk. I should be able to. Alright, let's see. Now, everyone is busy except for her. Now what, let's send her again for more... How? Judgment, how could you? I think I need all my people to do those things. Ah, shit. If you finish the main quest, well, then I won't go any... In, yeah, anytime soon. No, the main quest is out of the question. Alright, let me send Josephine and we are off to the Exalted Plains. The f a cheesy shield, okay. At your service. Off to the Exalted Plains. It has been overdue. Huh. Yeah, 86 hours. Ah, the main quest in Crestwood. <laughs> okay, give me a moment, please. 